just so honestly so so grateful and um, you know everyone's spoken tonight about the kind of uniqueness of these awards and that you know the public have voted you know the theatre goers who come and have supported our shows so yeah it really means a lot you know there was such a huge rally of support behind me in the show when we started and um, so this is really beautiful yeah the script honestly like when I, I got sent the script in the first lockdown and I remember reading it and being completely blown away by it and I was just like but how 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 do I do this why why is it in my inbox and um, so yeah it was the writing um, and you know the the subject in which the play speaks about I thought was hugely important and um, so yeah Remarkable, you know. I remember the first night, the first preview, and um, it was the first time we did it in front of an audience, and actually hearing the reactions from many women in the audience, and it was in that moment we realised that actually this play is so much bigger than all of us. And then to see then, you know, the support for the school's consent project, like how many uh, people donated. You know, people were going home and they were carrying on the conversation. Um, and it just seems like it's either comforted people or inspired them or gave them um, some sort of confidence within themselves to, um, yeah, to maybe face things that they hadn't before. Um, I mean, it's, it's like the, it's been the most incredible um, experience. I think the new discoveries you know, I'm. It, I think that's the beauty of theatre, and what I came to appreciate was like every night is so so different, and I, I love that now I know I can do it. So now it's about hopefully relaxing and enjoying it. You know, I think not letting fear get in the way and like fully embracing it and enjoying it and playing around. So yeah. I mean, I really want to do a musical. I've been saying this. <laughs> like 10 years but um what musical i don't know but i really 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 want to do a musical um, and james beerman our producer is the most exquisite producer so i'm going to keep him very close by and maybe get him to conjure something up for me i mean i will i'll work on that tonight i will work on that tonight uh, she's re she's remarkable i mean she, Rebecca is so incredible. I remember like, you know, when we first started working with the music in rehearsal and she's so unique um, and fearless, you know, like when you're around someone like that, it makes you want to kind of step up and celebrate that within yourself. So I feel incredibly lucky that she's part of the team. I want to hear those dog sick tones show here. You want to be the one? I want to hear your dog sick tones singing. <laughs> Not right now. I've got to save something. <laughs>